Infusion Reactions The following are important points that we would like to talk about in the next few minutes. Infusion reactions can be similar to allergic reactions that people experience with some medications. Infusion reactions tend to happen while you are at the cancer clinic getting treatment. If you start to feel unusual symptoms, call your nurse right away. If you are given medicine to take before your infusion, please make sure you know how to take them. The cancer medications you are receiving have a risk of causing infusion reactions, which can be similar to having allergic reactions to medications. The reactions you can experience can be mild or severe, and it is not possible to predict whether you will develop them or not. Before your treatment starts, you will be given medications to prevent or reduce the severity of an infusion reaction. These medications may be given as pills that you can take at home or at the clinic or medication that is given intravenously right before your treatment starts. Or, the doctor may have prescribed tablets for you to take at home before you arrive in the clinic. Sometimes, these tablets have to be taken one day or even several days before your scheduled treatment appointment. Please make sure that it is clear to you which instructions you were given regarding these medications. Mild reactions include flushing of the face, a mild itchy rash, or some cramping or muscle pain. Severe reactions can include hives, shortness of breath, tightening of the throat, and possibly swelling of the lips. If you start to feel unusual symptoms during your treatment, report it to your nurse right away. If you don't experience symptoms during your first infusion, the chance for an infusion reaction next time will be smaller. For most people who don't have a reaction during the first or second treatment, it is not likely to occur in future treatments. The nurses in the cancer care team have been specially trained to manage any infusion reaction. If a reaction occurs, the nurse will temporarily stop the infusion and provide you with medications to treat their reaction. The medications they give you can cause you to be drowsy and dizzy. Once you have recovered from your infusion reaction symptoms, the nurse will slowly restart your infusion. After your treatment is completed, it is possible to have some late effects at home although this is uncommon. If you develop any symptoms, contact your cancer care team right away. If the clinic is closed and your reactions seem severe, please go to the emergency. To summarize, infusion reactions are similar to allergic reactions that people experience with some medications. Infusion reactions tend to happen while you are at the cancer clinic getting treatment. If you start to feel unusual symptoms, call your nurse right away. If you are given medicine to take before your infusion, please make sure you know how to take them. Do you have any questions about this information? Please pause the video and take a moment to write them down right now.